So, welcome to Pictures Church and Monastery Buildings in Bulgaria Digital Collection. My name is Marina Georgieva and I would like to introduce you to the collection navigation features. First, I would like to point your attention to this navigation bar here on the top. There are a few different buttons that will take you to different sections of our digital collection. For instance, if you want to browse all the items that are hosted in our digital collection, you simply need to click on the Browse All button. And uh, the page with all the buttons will be loaded, like this one here. So, if you wish to change the display options, you can simply do that by clicking on the display options button here. And you can um, pick thumbnail with a title view. So, it will reload the page for you. And you will get the thumbnails of all the resources and the title underneath the image. So, um, this is very uh, neat and convenient feature. It's called the quick view. So when you hover with your mouse over the item, either its image or the title, you will get this uh, convenient quick view option that lists the title, the church monastery name, the location and the type of the church. So if you want to navigate back to the home page from where we started, simply click on the logo of the collection and you will be taken to this home page. I would also want uh, like to show you these recent additions here in this yellowish rectangular. You can see the last six items that were uploaded to the collection. You can quickly view them by, by hovering with the mouse and you will get the same quick view uh, option to read briefly the, <clears throat> the item title and the item location. You can also quickly look uh, what the collection is about right here underneath the collection picture. Also, uh, you can quickly jump to any of these suggested topics that you view here. So, if for instance you would like to explore all the Orthodox Eastern monasteries, we have provided a convenient link for you. So, if you click on this link, you will be taken to all the items that are um, listed with a subject. Uh, Orthodox uh, Eastern monasteries. So again, as we, as you remember, we set the display options to thumbnails, and we can easily switch back to the grid view simply by selecting this option. I personally prefer this uh, grid view because it not only gives you the thumbnail and the title, but it also gives you the brief description. So you can easily determine if a resource is helpful for you or not. Um, and if it is, you can further explore it by clicking on the title and going into the resource. Or if not, you can just uh, skip and continue to the next one. There is another way to get back to the home page. Uh, so uh, you can simply click here on the bottom, the home button and you will be again taken to the home page. So I would also like to point out these convenient buttons audio, video, books and photographs and monastery guides. Basically by clicking on them you will be taken to the section that hosts the resources of this type. So for instance now I clicked on books and I am taken to uh, the section that contains all the books hosted in this digital library. You can further narrow your search by um, uh, here on the left side on this um, toolbar you can narrow the search by a church and monastery type. So as you can see there are uh, for instance four churches that are called uh, Orthodox Eastern Monasteries or there are three different historic buildings, or there is one uh, cave monastery.